Let me show you a little demonstration of the new features for the next version of E-Life. Um, this is about the borders, which has a lot of features. For example, we can see here four buttons, because sometimes you want to close and uh, m maximize and full screen and minimize. Uh, there is also a little helper for when you cannot close the window because it's uh, hung it on or something like that. Uh, it appears a new button on which you have the kill feature. But there is a lot of more features if you mouse over this section. Lots of buttons with features. For example, we have a This one, which is the um, Exposite, um, you can organize better your desktop like this. Very nice and handy for novice users. Uh, this is also the window switcher, which includes all the windows or all the desktops, as we can see here, a new pop-up, and it didn't set fault, which is very nice. What we have more, this is the um, transparency levels, so you can configure with your window to be more transparent or less. This is the, um, how is the name? Um, I don't know, it, do, it does that. And this is very nice, is um, my favorite alternative to minimize, because uh, the people likes to minimize windows, which is not useful and handy at all. Uh, which does that, but it's not handy to have the windows here. So a much better way to organize your desktop is using this feature, which moves your window to the next desktop. Which is very nice. And so, what more? This is a rising level and lower level. It's not implemented yet. This is for organize the windows on the desktop. As we can see here, it has reorganized all the windows. And this is for open a new um, instance of the same application. It works uh, pretty well. New instance. Yeah. And this is a um, shield. It's about uh, immortalize uh, options, like uh, unable to close the window. This is the remember options. This is the maximize to left and maximize to right. It can be useful. And this is a help. It's also not yet implemented. And well, that's all. Thanks for watching.